हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस सेशन लेट अस सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन ऑफ बेंडिंग इक्वेशन इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट द मैक्सिमम स्ट्रेस इंड्यूस्ड इन ए कास्ट आयरन पाइप ऑफ एक्सटर्नल डायमीटर 40 मिलीमीटर एंड इंटरनल डायमीटर 20 मिलीमीटर एंड लेंथ 4 मीटर व्हेन द पाइप इज सपोर्टेड एट इट्स एंड एंड कैरीज अ पॉइंट लोड ऑफ 80 न्यूटन एट इट्स सेंटर so this is a question of bending stresses where the cast iron pipe is given external die is given 40 mm internal die given 20 mm length is also given 4 m there is a point load of 80 newton at the center we have to determine the bending stress maximum bending stress induced in the beam so let us solve in this question we are given with a shaft which is acting as a beam now and it is a hollow a load of 80 kN is applied and it is simply supported at two ends we have to find out the maximum shear stress in the material right so it is a hollow uh, beam shaft which is acting in like a beam now and it is of 20 mm inner dia 40 mm outer dia we have to find the maximum stress in the material bending stress basically you know that the maximum bending stress is at the outer periphery outer fiber so if we look at the type of stress distribution in this material at any cross section you will see in theory lecture also you have seen that this type of stress will stress structure will come in between there is a hollow no stress will be there and then there will be stress like this which will be increasing and it the linear line will pass through the center and then again here also this type of stress condition will be there this type of stress condition will be there in this material like this right and on one end it will be tensile and on other end it will be compressive so this this type of stress uh, condition will be there and sigma max will be at the outer periphery or outer fiber and we know the formula formula for maximum stress bending formula basically what is bending formula m by i equal to sigma by y and sigma is maximum at the y when the y is maximum and what is y maximum that is the outer fiber right so from here we can find out sigma max that is given as m y max by i this is the formula but here bending moment is also changing because it is a simply supported beam and you know for simply supported beam bending moment diagram remember the bending moment diagram for simply supported beam if this is the reference line ab then bending moment is maximum at the center maximum at the center like this this is maximum linearly maximum here remember the remember the diagram now go to the shear force bending moment diagram chapter and find out m max m max is at center and that is given by w l by 4 this is the value uh, you should go in the chapter of shear force bending moment diagram there we have find out the maximum bending moment and maximum bending moment is occurs at the center given by w l by 4 so length of the beam should have also is given 4 meter so length is also given uh, that is 4 meter Four meter is length of the uh, beam. So here, maximum stress will be uh, maximum. The stress will be maximum at the where the bending moment is maximum. So we can further modify this formula as out of this, this m is also maximum m max, and then y max, and then i. So this is the maximum stress. So sigma max will be equal to m w m max. and what is w this is a load applied this w is a load applied right so this is the w so we can write m max is w l by 4 multiplied by y max y max is the outer 
periphery outer fiber that is 40 mm so 40 by 2 outer from from neutral axis so it is basically ra outer radius so this is d by 2 d outer d outer basically by 2 divided by i i for circular section is pi by 64 d outer to the power 4 minus d inner to the power 4 right so this is the sigma max right this is the sigma max for our question of study so this is 8 it's uh, 64 so it will come out to be 8 w l 8 w l d naught upon pi d o minus d i to the power 4 so this is our sigma max put the value of quantities here and you will get the answer 8 w w is the load applied 80 kilo newton so 80 kilo newton for kilo we have multiplied with 1000 l l is the length length is 4 meter so if we take in millimeter you will get the answer in mega pascal we can take it in millimeter so that answer can be converted into mega pascal right multiplied by outer diameter that is 40 mm 40 mm divided by pi d outer is 40 d inner is 20 solve it try it solve it take your time so it will come out to be 13.6 mega pascal so finally maximum stress maximum bending stress in the material will be 13.6 mega pascal so this is the answer so how we have done it uh, we have simply spotted beam uh, loaded with 80 kN point load at the center we know for that the bending moment diagram is like this and the maximum bending moment is at the center which is given by wl by 4 we know the bending formula m by i sigma by y or sigma max by y max so sigma max will be m y max by i but the bending moment is changing on the entire length so maximum stress will be at the center at the outer periphery maximum stress will be at the center where the maximum bending moment is maximum of that outer periphery of the center so m max which is at the center y max outer uh, fiber of the material by i so this is the maximum stress so this is wl by 4 this is half of the diameter outer diameter and this is the moment of inertia solve it you will get this answer the stress maximum stress is 13.6 megapascal